Welcome. Hi, I'm Mickey from Active Panda, and today in one of my t <laughs> ticks and tricks, little tips and tricks of how to live better, live energized. Um, and today I'm just going to show you something that you can do in minutes, and that something is just going to help you set you up for the day or just set you up for that task that you're just about to go into or that meeting. Just a little bit of unraveling, yeah? Because lots of us, bad posture. I see people standing at bus stops, oh, they're all, they're all crunched up. We're gonna un uncrunch that, yeah? So let's come to standing. And after you do this, you can jump over to my YouTube and watch the full length version, yeah? That sounds great, doesn't it? So let's stand up. Um, just even when you're standing, look at that. This is how people are standing at the bus stop, looking at their phone, terrible. Or standing like this, blocking the energy channels, walking around like that, look at that back, terrible. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna unravel that. So let's come to standing. Even when you're standing, be aware of how you're standing. Catch yourself on every time you do this. Standing, pressing the weight through all four corners of your feet. Become aware by just circling the weight around your feet now over to the edge of the right, back to the heels, over to the edge of the left, forward into the toes, back over to the edge of the right. Become aware of the weight, how it's balanced on the sole of your foot. From there, bend the knees, activate these big thigh muscles, tuck your tailbone in so it's not this, it's this. So you, when you lift up from the pubic bone, you're already starting to feel longer. Extend your arms out, extend the fingers overhead, and stop. From there, circle those arms round and catch the fingers together at behind your back. Bring the palms together now, so it's not this, it's this. Squeeze the, sh roll the shoulders up towards your here and squeeze the shoulder blades together. From there, keep those knees slightly bent and fold at the hips. Keep the back straight by stretching the arms out behind you, squeezing the shoulder blades together, you're halfway. Now, bend the knees further and fold all the way down. Release the hands, palms on the floor, step back the right foot you're in this low lunge. So from here, extend the arms out, bring the arms again, look at those fingers, flick the fingers, bring the palms together, exhale, heart center. Here we go, we're gonna twist. So when you twist, you take the navel round to the left. So it's not just bringing my arms round, that's, that's not a disco move like this, it's this. So I always use the analogy of squeezing a dishcloth and the dirty water coming out and then it's clean. That's what we're doing, squeezing the dishcloth. Squeeze, right elbow outside of the left knee and push the elbow and the knee together so you twist round to the left. Keep the thumbs at the sternum so it's not this, it's not leaning on that leg. You're actually quite high up. Breathe one. And at the end of each exhale, let the tummy relax. Two, three, and on four, come back to center. Hands either side of that front foot, step forward. We're back in that forward fold. Keep the knees bent, roll up. And when you're rolling up, stack each vertebrae, activate the thighs, lift up from the pubic bone, extend the the arms out, flick the fingers overhead, back down, and then we're gonna do the same thing again. Bring the arms round your back. This time when you connect the fingers, move it up or down one so the opposite finger is on top. So squeeze the palms together, squeeze the shoulder blades together by moving the arms away from your body, bend those knees again, halfway fold. So extend, squeeze the shoulder blades together and then go all the way down. Bring the arms up and then bring the hands down to the floor. You're gonna step back the left this time. That low lunge again. Extend the arms out. 
bring them, flick those fingers. This is brilliant for foam fingers. Honestly, it is, it's great. Bring the arms up, bring them down, bring them up, bring them down. You can do this about a hundred times. Palms together, exhale, heart center. Twist, hook that tip of the elbow. So stop this knee moving around by pushing the knee into the elbow. Squeeze. So when you squeeze that, squeeze. And you're getting this wonderful spinal twist from the base of your spine all the way up to your neck. Breathe deeply there, one, two, and on three, come back to center. Frame that front foot, step back, forward fold. Flick the fingers. Now in that just very, very, very brief sequence there, your back already feels quite well released. You could be doing that every single morning before you go to work, before you start anything, maybe even at the end of your day or add it into your practice before you go out for your morning run or your morning walk. And even better, jump over to my YouTube channel and watch the whole thing.